Today I'll tell you about Seon Cool Mods, a kind of vanilla plus, a foundation you really should have cause they don't re radically change the gameplay but significantly improve the vanilla experience. That's why I recommended playing with these mods. I'm about to list, if you like this kind of content, hit the subscribe button, smash the like and drop in a comment with which mods you play maybe, I'll make a part 2 if this goes well. Also check out, anyway, we begin, rename faction with keyboard. Uh, this mode, just be the faction leader and click rename faction and next to the faction name in the politic tabs, click the flag and in the top left corner you just can rename the faction uh, it supports english russian polish and german keyboards let's uh, with the motocom it actually renames the faction uh, the only one thing you need to like uh, reload game and then faction was renamed and you don't need to remake the aliens just rename it and it done it done the name change is saved even if you remove the mode it works in multiplayer too you can use up to 32 characters and even more special symbols and just be careful if you're playing in english some character from other language might not render correctly doing font limitation this mod doesn't get in your way but but adds functionality. Next, no undeletable units. Hey, this unremovable division in new focus trees like USSR, Italy, Switzerland. This mod fixed that. It make it makes all division fully uh, ed editable and deletable. I once conquered the world as Italy and has a super strong army. All converts into a great tank force but i had like 10 uh, useless division i couldn't delete to, to game mechanics they annoyed me to the end and this mod solves that must have for clean armies toolpack without the rows you probably know toolpack it adds tons of tools like border adjustments spawning division and more but the original mod has been abandoned and is outdated stuck on version 1.12 or something so it throws errors on current version uh, that's why this toolpack tool without errors fully updated for modern version and works without bugs not iron man compatible and the activation button is about the map option in the lower right uh, once one click a state in map mode and to use it it also uh, improves some features updated infrastructure results fixed broken election toggle, fixed capital relocation, fixed ship spawns and deletions, new elements like fuel elevators, railways, building spawns, new puppet degrees, more resource control and a lot of another. But don't forget to disable it before Iron Man session, but for casual gamers it's gold. Next colored puppets. Uh, this mode improves map quality by coloring puppets in the color of the overlord. It uses under toolist uh, mechanics so it's compatible with almost all mods including major ones like Kaiserreich on, and the road to 56. Super simple, super effective, makes the map easier on the eyes. You can also get set it to work for the AI puppets too, just a very pleasant mod, highly recommend it. Get rid of annoying puppet troops. A simply but very necessary mode is prevents your puppets from constantly sending you their division. You know that struggle puppet keeps offering you useless troops and you keep declining it. This mode stops that once and for all. It works with all modes. Uh, it rumors have seriously install this FPS map. If your PC is from the Mesoic era and game time equals real world time, this mod is your saver. It optimizes the game, improves FPS and enhances visual. It reduces shaders, removes water reflection, shaders, map colors and adds cult icons. Surprisingly, even people with decent rigs like the new look more and looks good and adds FPS win-win 
highly recommend it. And the last one, more division icons. Expands the election of division icons by adding all base unit icons and a lot of new ones. Great for Wesley and its Iron Man compatible bonus points. Unfortunately, the original mod was abandoned, but now the more division icons fixed, updated for modern version, works great, use it happily. That's all for now. If you like this, subscribe so you don't miss more interesting videos and features parts of this series. Uh, leave a comment with your favorite modes, ones you use from this list maybe or others I didn't uh, mention. And also like and anyway, see you soon.